Monkey 1000. I got a new unboxing to do by Ipsy. No, I am not sponsored by them. I just thought it would be fun to try them out. Um, what you do, you spend um, $10 and they uh, once a month and they send you um, some makeup. So I thought I would try this. Let's try it. Okay, everybody, I'm going to lower you down so you can see a little bit. It'll take me just a second. Here we go. Okay. There we are. Anyways. Yeah, that should be good. I have my bread here. Okay, so I got this. Isn't it pretty? Really pretty. And it's by Ipsy. Um, they have all kinds of products, makeup products. So I thought I'd like to do some kind of, um, you know, these boxes and see how how they work and, and see if I like them. And that I probably do a few of these and then I'll carry on to something else. Um, see how well they are. The one thing I did notice that when you when you buy, you're on a waiting list with them. So then they all accept you. And it's usually because of when, whatever time you, you decided you wanted it. So they go to August. And then as they be, just before they're sending it, they'll send you an email saying, oh, if you want to buy these products, we can add this into your package. So they kind of want you to buy more and more, right? Well, that's the whole idea. Anyways, with this is my first time ever getting them. So with my product, I get a new little makeup bag if you can see that yeah isn't it cute it is green not my favorite color but that's okay very nice i've never had a makeup bag i always throw my makeup in it in my purse and then i'm done <laughs> uh, so i'm not much for makeup i i try to keep as natural as possible um i just don't like all that stuff on my face and with my job it doesn't really work and when you live in Florida makeup comes off faster and then it does stay on because of the moisture and stuff so I, I try not to I like to use it when I go out at an evening or something special but most of the time I just keep natural and I use my um, my face cream every day that has sun protection in it so because I get a lot of sun beaming off my my truck so um, I'm always afraid that I'm going to get skin cancer on my face, so I use a lot of it. So, what I get, they give you a pamphlet here, and these are, I get five things. I get five things, so we'll go through them, okay? So, the first one is the Belief Moisturizing Eye Balm, which I'm going to use. I was quite interested in this eye balm. Hope you can see it. It is small. See how small it is? But it is only 10 bucks. So, <laughs> you know, what can you expect? But these are like little samples. So you can try them and see if you like them. And then you can buy them later. And I think they come in bigger, bigger amounts. Oh, nice. And you know what it smells like? Mac, oh, what is that? Face cream. Maxime, I think it is. Oh yeah, that's what it smells like. <laughs> but I, 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 one thing about my eyes, I always get dark circles underneath them and they are sagging like a puppy dog kind of thing. So as I get older, so this might be a good thing. I'm always looking, I used to buy, um, they have a stick that you buy a roll on and it's a cooling stick and it helps for blackness underneath your eyes and stuff and it does work it has it has worked but um and it lasts a long time i can't remember the name of it but i did buy that at walmart so okay there's your first one you get and what's the next one um let me see i'm trying to take me out in order so you can see yeah, this is the Peach Waterproof Mascara. Okay. I think this is... Yeah. Beach Waterproof Mascara. Hmm. So that's cute. Tiny. But you know, these are kind of good because you could take them in your car. I don't know if you guys are seeing this very well or not. I don't know. It's very dark in here. 
looks like it anyways. Yeah, see, I'll try to bring it up as close as I can. And it's, it's a dark blue, so maybe that helps a little bit. Maybe that'll work. Lighting in here is not the best. There we go. Yeah. So anyways, this is supposed to be waterproof mascara. Yeah. Which is good to have in Florida with all the swimming you like to do. As long as it's not with the alligators. Well, that'll be nice. It's black. Well, it rubbed off really. So I'll have to try it on and see if I like it. And what's the next one? Um, the highlighted. Is this it? No, this is it. Uh, where's the highlighted? The highlight is in this, in here. Okay, so here is the baked highlighted powder. And they're supposed to be all name brands and stuff. This, I guess, says Estate on it. So, hmm, we'll see. I'm not happy with the lighting here. There we go. I think you can see that one a little bit. Um, I don't know why it's so dark. I always do them here, so. Yeah, let me turn on my other light and see if I can get it to be a little brighter. Help a little bit. Oh, there. Yeah, maybe. Does that help a little bit? Maybe? There you go. See, you can see that. And if you couldn't see this before, maybe you can see a little bit better now. There you go. So, this is, what's this one? It says, I can't read staying things. Audio. Um, their adorable packaging. Estates products are all cruelty free. Oh, huh? I can't read. Oh, my eyes are so bad. Let me try my other glasses. I got new ones and I had to go up one. I was hoping. So let me see if this is better. Yeah. Uh -uh. That means I'm going up in my glasses. Okay. So it says, aside from their adorable packaging, Estates products are all cruelty-free, something else free, and phosphate-free. The light gold pearl finish highlighter will take you from natural radiant to glow in a free swipe. swipe. In a free swipe. Plus, the baked formula feels velvety, velvetly smooth on your skin. Hmm. So, let me see here. So you swipe the highlight onto the high points of your face, like your temples, your brow, your bones, your cheekbones, your nose, your cupid bones, and your chin. Use it to brighten the inner corners of your eyes too. Hmm. Okay. Well, this is what it kind of looks like. Let me see here. I'm just going to put it on my arm so you can kind of see if I can open it. I hate new packaging sometimes. These things are horrible. Aha. Uh -huh. I see. And oh, nice. Oh, look. It glows. It has a glowing effect to you, yeah, if you can see that glowing. And this is the opening of it. And I'm going to put it on my hand here, see what it does. It's nice. It feels it's nice and smooth. And you, it gives you a kind of a glow. It'd be nice for evening and stuff. You go out in the evening and you want a little glow on your face. That would be cute. Oh, I probably will use these stuff. Okay, the next one we have is the skincare balancing mask and the green tea. Okay, so they give you, it's the balancing mask. And I don't usually use masks too much. I'm always afraid of them pulling my skin and making, causing, um, you know, your skin to kind of wrinkle more. But a lot of people use them for, you know, blackheads and stuff like that. So they 
would be a lot of people like them. Um, so they got a cap thing on there, and I'll have to maybe maybe go in the bathroom and do a mask thing and try it out. <laughs> and we'll have to try that one out. Um, it says, apply a thin layer of this mask over clean uh, skin. Let it sit for 10 minutes without letting it dry too much. Rinse off with lukewarm water. Dab off any traces with a wet cotton swab. So very simple, not too bad. So they give you a mask. And the last thing they give you is your face blush. It's called Whispering Pink. Now when you first when you first sign up with them, they ask you a bunch of questions, you know, what you like, what you don't like, what's your favorite colors and, and stuff like that. So then they kind of get the idea of what to send you for your skin type and, and what you may like. Um, some people have darker skin, lighter skin, and, and stuff. So let me see. I want to open this up and see what it's like. And they got tape on here, so I don't know if I can get it open or not. Let me see here. I'm trying to, maybe I can use the scissors a little bit. Mm. Oh, this is terrible. But I guess I have to do it, right? Keep everything protected. It's a shame. I remember when you bought makeup and you didn't have all this stuff. You know? But. Uh, new, t new world, that's for sure. There's a seam, I think, over here. Make life easier. See, there's a seam. I found it. <laughs> All right, so struggling. Struggle for nothing. Oh, now this stuff wants to stick to me. Oh, that's pretty. I am a pink girl. I like pastel colors mostly. Um, yeah, go figure. I like pastel colors, but mostly my wardrobe is black and white and brown. I do have some colors. Not too much, though. And my sundresses now, I go into the colors. That's pretty. It says, dip a fully blush brush into whispering pink. Top off an excess. Smile big. See the ap ap apples of your cheek. Swirl the blush onto them and blend in a circular motion. Yeah, okay. Well, we'll just try Try it here on my hand here. Uh, we'll do it right in there on the wrist. Oh, that's pretty. It's not real heavy. It's nice and light, which I like. Uh, uh, the light, I like the light stuff, so. Oh, that's pretty. Oh, I might like this stuff. Yeah, that's very, very pretty. And, and that's it. Um, I, I'm, I like this. I like what I see. Now uh, I'm excited to try. I will try the mask and maybe I'll videotape it. So you can see, we'll go into the bathroom and we'll, we'll try this. And then maybe I'll try my eye mask, my eye, my eye stuff. This might be good for morning and I'll try it tomorrow and see if I like it. Maxima. That's what it smells like, Maxima. Hmm. And it's got, it's nice. It's a little heavy, but not real heavy cream. So maybe it'll help my eyes. Oh, that would be great. Because I hate my eyes underneath. They got baggy baggies. Okay, so let's go. And I'm going to turn you off for a minute. And I'm going to take you into the bathroom. And we'll, we'll try the mask. Let's try the mask on, okay? We'll be right back. Okay, we're back, and now we're in the bathroom. So now I'm just going to wet my washcloth here. It says it wants you want your face clean, so you want to make sure you you wipe your face, like I'm going to. Make sure you make sure it's clean. Uh, a lot of people use soap on their face. I don't. I use just water, and I let it go. Um, reason is because why you put on your face? 
the more I feel that you get wrinkles and it's not healthy. And I don't have any blackheads. I don't have that problem. Thank goodness. I used to when I was a kid, but I don't anymore. And I don't know if it's because I drink lots of water, which I do, tons of water, more than I ever did in my life. Um, so I have to. It, it's for my, you know, I have to fight diabetes here. Yeah, I'm not, I don't want to be my parent, so hopefully not. So anyways, I have to look because I can't see a dang thing anymore. So, um... Okay, after that, you, you clean it and then just put a thin layer, it says, not a heavy layer, and you just put it all over your face. So it does have a little, a little thing here, if you can see it. No, I can't see you, but you can see me, hopefully. Um, huh. Yeah. Now if I can get this off without glasses out. Yeah, right. That, that's, that's a joke on its own there. Yeah. Okay, so this little thin thing here, let me see if I got something in here that I can just poke. There's always something in my drawer somewhere. And I'll just poke it real quick. There we go. Alrighty. Yeah. And I'm just going to take some. Oh, it's green. Of course, as you know, it's green. So we're going to put this all over our face. And I hope you can see me. Oh, lovely. Yeah. I might scare Shea Bear, so I won't let him see me like this. Huh? He'll probably watch the video. I'll tell him. Oh, this is girl video. You don't need to watch it, right? Ha! Ha! Hey, I'm using the camera for my mirror here. That works out pretty good. <laughs> Let's put a little bit more on here. It's quite nice. It really doesn't have a smell to it. Um, no, no smell. I'm not gonna do my neck. I'm just gonna do it to basically show you guys and to see what happens. Now, if this thing doesn't come off, I'm gonna have one green face. So. <laughs> It better come off. Yeah. Alright, let me look in my mirror and see what I got going. Oh my. Hey, be a good Halloween thing. <laughs> I mean, you can get underneath your eyes or whatever you want to do. Get my side, my cheeks here. Alright, I'm going to get Alexa to say 10 minutes. And then we'll, I'm trying to get everywhere, as you see. Okay, so there you are. Ooh, pretty. What women do to be pretty for men. So I hope they appreciate it. Anyways, I'm going to, I can't believe I'm doing this. <laughs> I'm going to get Alexa to put the timer on for 10 minutes and I will be back. Okay guys, I am back and nice and green. Bruno was afraid of me. He backed up behind the de the door. <laughs> he wasn't sure who I was. And then he would wag and look and then he's like cocking his head. It was so cute. Anyway, so now what you do, you take warm water and you basically wipe it off. It's not a peel mask, it's just a, a white one. So. Which is good, because I'd rather not peel. I'm not into the peel ones. Um, let me get the water warm here. And you just rinse it off. And then if you have any access, you take a cotton ball and, and just kind of go over a damp cotton ball and just wipe out top. I think it takes any of the dead skins or, or dry cells and stuff off. If you didn't get it off from the washcloth, so... We'll get this nice and warm. It's warm here. There we go. Finally. And I'm going to wipe it off here. I'm sure you all know how to wipe. It's not a big thing. Just wipe it off. I just hope my face ain't going to be green. That won't be good for work. 
and I'll have a lot of explaining to do to my patients. But then some of them can't see real well because they're, you know, 90 and stuff, so I can tell them, you know, a story or two. Oh, oh hey, hey, my. And then these two glasses. That would not be nice. <laughs> Anyways. It feels really nice. Um, you know, I'm not really a green person, but oh well. I guess it won't really matter if it's a mask. There you go. Get a little bit more here. I'm going to take cotton swab on. I didn't do my neck. You could probably do your neck if you wanted to. Um, you know, it is a little harder to get off. Uh -huh. I see some green in here. Oh, better not turn my face green. I'm going to be upset. So there is some still on there. But I can't see real well because I ain't got my glasses on. So I'll have to check it with my glasses. And I suck. My eyes are getting bad. Not a good time. So you see how it leaves the, the green on. So what I'm going to do is take a cotton swab and we'll roll over it with lukewarm water again. And it's still coming off, I think. Yeah. It takes a little bit, and it's not easy to get it off, that's for sure. But, oh no. I'm gonna panic, I can't get it off. See, it's still coming off. It's still coming off. Wow. Huh? And I put a thin layer on there. Maybe next time I'll put even a, a thinner layer. I don't know. Because there's still quite a bit there. Mmm. It feels good. I mean, it feels nice on the face, so. Yeah, it'll be nice to do. Yeah. I don't want to find something on this. I don't really fuss too much. Yeah. I do. You like to. I'm pretty once in a while. Not like it used to be. Yeah. I used to wear makeup every day, dressed up every day, like I was in the office. Well, I did, I worked in, in some offices and stuff, so I had to dress nice. But it gets expensive. And uh, now I just wear what I want and wear my scrubs to work and that's it. And all the clothes that I wore, nice, sitting in the closet. Sometimes I, I get tired of wearing scrubs, so, yeah. I think everybody gets tired of the same thing all the time. Anyways, so it's nice. In uh, Florida, I just put on a, uh, I'm using some more here. It's still coming off. Wow, it is hard to get off. So if you can't see your bed, you're having trouble with your hands or anything, you may not want to do it. Um, you know, for younger people who who can see and you know they like to do these things. Fine. Um, I don't know how much I'll use it. Let's see how I feel. Maybe use it a few times to see how it is. You know, it's still coming off. Ah, see, it's still coming off. Terrible. So, anyway. I think I got most of that off. There. Okay, I think so. Now I think I'm okay. Let me check with my glasses here. And we'll check. Well, yeah, I still see a little bit of residue. It feels soft though. It does feel nice. Yeah. It didn't get real tight. No. Mm -mm. It's not for that. It's, it's just a, a little thing for refreshing and uh, yeah, it just says to put it in there on and let it sit for 10 minutes and without letting it dry too much you don't want to let it dry completely where it's going to crack 
Um, rinse off with lukewarm water. Dab off any traces with a wet cotton wash swab. So there you go. Now let me try. Since we're in the bathroom, this is the waterproof mascara. I will do one eye and then I'll face you so you can see the difference. If you can see the difference. Now I have to kind of use my glasses too so I can see what I'm doing. It's terrible. Just terrible. I'll do this one eye and then you can tell the difference. Uh, it's supposed to be waterproof. Uh, I haven't worn this stuff in a long time either. Let me um, get a little tissue here and I'm going to dab it so I don't have a black eye. But if it's waterproof it shouldn't be too bad. And there you go. So let me see. Yeah, it did clump a little bit. Have my brush with me. It is already dry, so there is a difference, and that one's not done, and this one is. I guess you can tell, right? Yeah, it ain't too bad. And let me see what else we got. Okay, let's try this. We'll try this glow thing. Oh, let's try this one first because that should go on first, anyways. I got water everywhere. This is the um, cream for underneath your eyes. So let's try it. I'll do the one side and I'll show you. Now, I don't know how long it would take for it. Let me see here. I brought directions in here so I know what I'm doing. After applying your regular moisturizer, use your ring finger to gently pat a pea-sized dab of this cream all around your eye area. So, I pretty much did that. There we go. And that is the cream for the eye. I'm going to use this every day. This will be gone in no time and I'll probably, you can buy bigger ones. So if you like this, like them, then, then you can buy the bigger ones, you know, and you don't have to spend all your money on the big one and then find out you don't like it. That's my thing. So after that, I'm going to just do one side, okay? And then you see the other side. Okay, so this is your kind of, your foundation kind of thing. It is a baked highlighter. Okay, it's for highlighting. And use a swipe of highlight onto the high points of your face. And it'd be your up here, you know, here, here, up here. This basically kind of gives you a glow when you do it. Um, geez, it's been a while. So let me see here. We'll get a little bit on here. And I'm going to do, we'll do this like on one side here. So you can kind of see the difference and see if you like it. Yeah. So I'm not going to do the whole face. Yeah. So this will be nice to use if I go out or something. I've got eye hair in my eye somehow. I hate that. My hair is getting too long. I want to get a cut, but every time I try to, I just don't have time. Running, running, running all the time. So, that has a nice, that's nice. I like that. Is And I probably, you know, I, I wouldn't cover the whole face. I'd probably just do up here and here and your nose and your chin area, basically. You know. There, I put a little bit on my chin, my nose, so you can tell. But you can, you know, play with it. Brush it around a little bit. So you can see the difference anyways. It's not too bad. Not bad. Kind of gives you a little glow. So when you go out in the evening, you know, that would be nice for evening. 
you know, going to a, a bar or, you know, a disco or just out in the evening time. I think I'd use that at night more. Okay, so this is like a blush. That's basically what this is. And what we do with this one? Yeah, dab your brush in here and you wisp it, basically. Just wisp it. You're gonna just do that. And you got the pink on there, nice and pinky. And it depends how much you want to use too. And you can dab it a little bit off to make sure. And then smile big and use it at your apples. So you're gonna smile and you're gonna do this. That's all you're gonna do. And sometimes I like, I do up here too, and I'll do here. And sometimes I'll do down here. Give me a glow. You see, now I'm really glowing. <laughs> oh my gosh. Anyways, not bad. Uh, yeah. So those are what I got from Tipsy. I'll put the um, information of the website just in case you're interested and wanted to try it yourself. Um, I've been curious about it and I thought I would try it and finally I did. I also will get another, um, I will get another uh, one next month, they only come monthly. So um, we'll do another one to see how it works, okay? And for now, uh, I think I look halfway. My now I'm lopsided. I got half makeup on one and none on the other. So, anyway, so hopefully you like the the video, and uh, we will check in next time for the uh, next month. The one we will get next month. So um, stay tuned for this. And monkey says she's out for now. Y'all have a good evening and a good weekend. Bye, y'all.